Hi fitness friends, today we have an upper body speedy sculpt workout that was written by our dear fitness friend Kristen Komu. So if you like this workout, make sure you tell her in the comment section. Alright, this speedy sculpt series is a series of workouts that we're going to try to get done in under 45 minutes. I mean, try and get them done in 40 minutes, not 45, because we want to have that 5 minutes left over to do a cool down. So under 40 minutes, we're going to really work hard, we're going to pack some punch into these quick workouts, all right? I will be using heavy, medium, and light weights, and my ball for this workout. You don't need a ball, but if you have one, go ahead and grab it. Let's get started. All right, I have a super fast two-minute warm-up for us to do together. So I'm gonna hit start on that. It's 30 seconds on, 30 seconds on, four moves. We're starting with a light jog in place and arm circles. This is an upper body focused workout. We are gonna hit some lower body, but we really want to focus on opening up our chest, getting our shoulders warmed up. So circle those arms, either jogging in place here, go the other direction. You can even do that Michael Phelps swimmer move where you wrap your arms around each other, just slap yourself in the back. Get your breath moving. We're going into a walkout. So at the top of your mat, reach up straight and tall. Touch your toes. If it's too hard to do that, bend your knees. Walk it out. Do a push up here if you want. If not, you don't have to do a push up. This is your warm up. Do what feels right to get your body moving. So we have five sets that are each focused on a different body part in our upper body. Next move is a down dog into a cobra. So into a nice high down dog position, press your heels into the mat. Each of these groups we're gonna be going through one time at 50 seconds on, 10 seconds off. There's six moves in each group. So each set or group is six minutes. We'll be doing tri triceps first. Our next move here is a squat. You keep your hands on your toes, so hop those feet in. Squat down, hands on your toes. Stand up here with your butt and back down. And stand up. Bring those hands up straight up above your head. Open up that chest. Pull your shoulder blades back together. Nice work. I think I left off saying we are doing a tricep first. Second is biceps, third is chest, fourth is shoulders, and our fifth set is back. These are all just our focus groups. I am going to set my timer for the first three sets. So we're gonna do triceps, biceps and chest before I reset my timer to do the last two sets, okay? We'll, we'll take a break after we do chest. So 50 seconds on, 10 seconds off for 18 minutes. That's what we're going for for our first group here. Take a deep breath, hitting start now. We don't want to waste any time. Beginning with a tricep kickback. I'm gonna go with 12 pounds in each hand. Bend forward. I will stay up and you're kicking it back, squeezing those triceps. Keep your abs in tight. We're only doing each of these moves one time. So once you're done with the move, you won't be doing it again. Make sure nothing else in your body is moving here. Those elbows are staying up, squeezing those triceps. You have 25 seconds left here. Come on, stay tight and strong. Breathe it out. By the end of these six moves, your triceps are going to be on fire. Five seconds. Oops, one second, sorry. Next, we're doing a tricep hold and plank jack. So set those weights down out of your way. Tricep hold, jacking those legs out. Let's go. 
If you can't hold this position for the whole 50 seconds, give yourself a number to count to as a goal, then pop it up and go right back in. The next move, you're on your back on the floor, is called a Tate Press. Arms are directly up above your shoulders, palms are facing out. You're bringing the weights in to your neck with your thumbs. Elbows out wide, squeeze up through your triceps. So your weights are coming together right under your chin. You're squeezing them up. Good morning, sweet girl.
your biceps, your elbows stay tight to your body. We're keeping our ball for the next move. If you don't have a ball, you can just do a seated bicep curl or you can push your back against the wall and do it like that. You just won't have quite as much range of motion because your weights will hit the wall. Next move, we're laying on the ball and doing a bicep curl. So put your belly on your ball and So get yourself seated, elbows come out front. It's kind of like a concentration type curl. Squeeze it up. Nice job. Squeeze those biceps. Really make it work, make it like you're making a muscle. Until the weather is cooler, my ball has shrunk. <sighs> Put more air in it. <sighs> Our mornings are definitely getting colder here. <sighs> so we still get dripping with sweat, just not quite as much, quite as quickly. <laughs> All right, third move is a burpee bicep curl. So get your ball out of the way. You do a regular burpee, push up at the bottom. Stand up, that's the curl. Push up, stand up, curl it. Down again. Up, curl. curl. Make sure you're not swinging those weights. You're using your biceps. Squeezing it. Okay, next move is a concentration curl. So you're gonna squat down, hold that squat, Brace your other hand on the inside of your leg, elbow on the inside of your knee, and curl that arm up. Squeeze it. Stick your butt back behind you. Get deep in the squat hold. Look at that muscle and watch it work while you're squeezing that weight up.
if you're burning too, if you need to come up and shake it out, get right back into it. Keep in it. Breathe it out. Don't forget to oxygenate those muscles. 15 seconds left. Let's go. Breathe. We're almost there. All right, we're going into chest. We have chest flies and a bridge hold. So get on your back, press that butt up in the air. Weights are directly above your chest, and you're doing a nice big chest fly. Control that movement. I'm sticking with 12 pounds here. Squeeze your butt. Out and in. My chest is already shaking. Squeeze at the top of that motion. Here we go. Second chest move is a staggered push-up burpee. So I'm just going to keep one weight in the center of my mat. One hand is up on the weight, other hand is on the ground. That's a stagger. Push up, switch hands, push up, jump it in, jump it up. So I'm doing two push-ups at each, at each burpee. I'm gonna jump up high there at the top. Just because we're working chest. Okay. We have a wide chest press and leg raise. So on your back again. So chest press, elbows out wide. Raise those legs up as you press the weights up. Squeeze your abs in tight. Exhale at the top of that motion. Nice work. Keep it going. Legs are straight and tight. Next, we have a diamond push-up burpee. So your hands are in a diamond shape at the bottom. Just like this. So close hands, push up. Push up. Jump in, jump up. Nice work. Twist, twist, bring it in. Hold that plie. 
twist, twist, in, twist, twist, in, come on, stay here, keep those knees out wide, sink down a little bit lower if you can, you have less than 20 seconds left here.
One set, 50 seconds of surrenders. Feet are up, above your shoulders, up overhead. Step it back, kneel it down, kneel the other leg down. Get up to stand, go on the other leg. Down, down, up, stand. Going. We got 20 seconds left here. Keep those weights up. Five seconds. Okay. Pike push up to an Arnold press. I'm gonna do my pike push up on my weights. So I hop it into that pike. Pike push up. You're using your shoulders. Hop it in. You get a little deadlift action here. Bring those weights up in front of you. Arnold press. Down. Deadlift it back down. Pike push up again. Hop it in. Squeeze it up. All right, so facing you, press it up. There we go. Same arm for B again. This is your last shoulder move. So switch arms. Single arm burpee, upright row on this side. Here we go. Hop it back, hop it in. Stand up, row it. Down, back. Moving into back next. Our first back move, you're gonna be using lighter weights. We're doing fly and plank and a fly at the top, otherwise known as a back fly burpee. Squeeze it. Down. All right, I'm gonna go with nine pounds in each hand for these flies. Keeping both hands on my weights and the plank to do the fly, and then again at the top. So, here we go. Hop it back. Squeeze your butt and your abs so you're not rocking all over the place when you do these flies. Hop it in. Stay bent. Fly. Squeeze your shoulder blades together. Nice job. Stay tight and strong. Okay, next move is a burpee, explosive push up and back extension. So weights out of your way. Load your feet and your hands off the ground for this explosive push up. Then go into a back extension, or back extension first, sorry. Back extension, explode. Hop it in, jump it up. Down, back extension. Explode. Hop it in, jump it up. Back extension. Don't jack your neck up when you do this. Keep your face facing the ground. Okay, bend row, deadlift 
it all the way down. Plank up. So heavy weights here. We're going to twin foot again. At the top of your mat. Bent over row. Deadlift it down. Plank up. Change this to palms facing forward row. Stay bent. Palms forward, row it. Down. You need to change your grip for that plank hop. That's okay. Stay bent. Row it. Up. Down. Plank hop. Reverse grip. Up. Row. Finish off that deadlift. Squeeze your butt. Down. Plank hop. Row. Down. Got the deadlift. We're going into lighter weights. Reverse lunge, single arm fly. Nine pounds again for me. So you're opening up to the fly on the leg that's going back. So like this, hands up front. Reverse lunge, fly. Up. Reverse lunge, fly. Make sure you have room. Fly it out. Up. Working those shoulders, working those chest, working your back. Stay here. This is killer. Four seconds. Nice big around the world arms. 
Get your legs spread a little bit apart. Your knees are soft. Squeeze those weights all the way around. This move works everything in your upper body. Keep your chest up, shoulders back. Stay tight and strong. Back to those plyo push-ups. Wide arm to tricep arm. Here we go. Wide arm. Triceps. Wide. Alright, 
four wide high knees. Drop and switch kicks. Let's do it. One, two, three, four. First side, uppers. Upper, upper, elbow, front kick. Here we go. Three. 
five. Next move is traffic director arms sticking with nines. My shoulders are dead. So out, lateral out front raise. One, two, three, four, five. All right, bicep curls, press out and rotate for five. Curl it out, in. Rotate and down. That's one. Press it out. Back in. Rotate. Two. Three. Four. Five. Lizard push ups. Set those weights down. Here we go. One hand, one foot. One, two, three, four, five. Burpees. Five. You only have a minute left. Let's go. Take some time for yourself. Give yourself five extra minutes. Cool it down, and I will see you next time.